Welcome, all you beautiful people. Doing more Dragon Quest XI S. The post game, just in case you haven't, um, some of you guys haven't been keeping up with the past uh, stream or two. Um, we have been doing the Dragon Quest XI S post game. So, yeah, we're on the third stream of the post game, I believe. <laughs> I believe so. And, uh, I remember now we were, sp um, we we're supposed to get the three seed. I believe I'm, I'm pretty, pretty sure you just fly to them. Cause I remember exactly where the, I remember they were on one of the, like, you have to like fly to one of the hidden, uh, hidden areas around the world. But as well, we have Rab here to give us the gist, the summary of what has happened. Having been sent by King Carnelian to see why Erdwinton's lantern is falling, our heroes lead southward to the Emerald Coast, where they see the great star floating sinisterly over Gallipolis. As the friends weigh up their options, the steer appears and explains that they must rise to Tessia to see watchers on their island in the, so in the sky. See the watchers. Before disappearing into thin air again. Joker summons Tessia as instructed, and after arriving at the Watcher's village, the party meet with the elder Eagle Tap. Eagle Tap. He tells he tells he tells them of the luminaries, uh, the luminary of Legends' battle with Kalasmos, the Dark One, and of how Joker is Joker Two is duty bound to try and defeat him. Next, they make their way to the Temple of Dawn to meet with another Watcher, he claims to have something he wishes to give our hero. There he receives the guiding light, but upon examining Idrisil's seedlings surrounding it, it is disappointed to see that they contain no clues as to how to beat Kalasmos. It seems the seedlings they need are somewhere on the surface of Erdria. Egotep imbues the friends with an intriguing new power and they set off to seek them out. Exactly. That's literally what we're going to be doing. So, just going to get the seeds. There's a bunch of like, really, like, a bunch of like, side stuff as well. Like, we can get the strongest weapon of, uh, the, the ultimate weapon of Silvando and H Hendrik. Um, I need to get, I need to get them both pepped up, though. So, that's that. Um. What is this, uh, what is this one here with the, quite, with the exclamation mark? Oh, Angula. Um. First... I want to go to uh, Sneffelheim or the yeah Sneffelheim. It might be more like side stuff with the other characters. This is where Eric, um, this is Eric's home or something of some or something like that. So maybe there's something, uh, Eric, uh, like a cutscene, that may appear or something like that, that will like. Help Eric get his ultimate weapon, similar to how Hendrik and Silvando get their ultimate weapon at Porto Valor. Doesn't seem like it though. Do, do, do. What's this? Uh, what's this one for? A plain, a plaintive voice drifting on the icy breeze. Not the cry of a monster. It sounds more like the voice of a young girl. The north of the Vikings hideout. Are you talking about the oh the sister? Has to be. Um Let me check something. Yeah, I am doing the post game exactly. That's exactly I just said, you know what? Let's go ahead and do it. Uh Viking hideout. So yeah, we're just gonna continue the post game. I'm trying to get like some side stuff out of the way but at the same time I'm not too too concerned about it but I do kind of want to see some of it here and there just some of it not all of it let's go see this should be where the girl is oh uh, the sister if this is what they were talking about it should be around here Oh, the Dragon Quest 3 main theme song. I love it. Oh, yep, here we go. Here we go. Nah, keep it. Conna talking to Samaraga. Oh, my need to is not a 
What's up, Eric? Thank you, Herbs, for the follow. Thank you so much. Eric tells a joke about his painful past and of how five years ago the necklace cursed turned out his sister to gold and led him to flee his homeland. But yeah, thank you so much. Hope you enjoy. If you like JRPGs, if you like fighting games, this is the spot. Haven't been streaming too many fighting games, sadly. But starting on Melty Blood release, I will. So for now, I've just been, like, on a break, honestly. Oh yeah, I forgot in the post game, since we went to the past, she still turned to gold. That's right, I forgot about that. I totally forgot about that. We freed her in the main area, but in going back to the past, she's back to being gold again. That's right, I remember. Maya. <laughs> Your powers are maxed out. <coughs> I would be easy, but I somehow don't seem don't feel like it's gonna be that easy. Is it going to be that easy? I remember they just had to destroy that necklace. Or take it off. Yep, they... Oh, wow, it was that easy. Oh, I love Dragon Quest. And yeah, the art style is amazing. They put so much, like, time and effort and money into this game. Everything is animated. Almost everything in the game is voiced. Not like you uh, most it's not like uh most games where you're spending a lot of time oh yeah text read you know more text with another another still shot you know something like that but uh, everything's fully animated honestly this game is probably probably uh my favorite game that I've played this year this game is amazing. いや、許してやれ。予言は本当だったってことか。ありがとうよ。おかげで俺の食材は果たされた。今度は俺がお前の期待に応えるバンだね。よろしく頼むぜ、相棒。Welcome, Eric. Yeah, if you like. Obviously, if you like turn-based JRPGs, the whole mainline numbered series is perfect for you. Even if you're not a fan of turn-based JRPGs, there's still the action-based one, Dragon Quest Heroes. If you, even if you like other things like Minecraft, there's Dragon Quest Builders. There's like so many different like types of uh, Dragon Quest uh, side like stories of different types of like way to plays the game. That it's just kind of it's just kind of you can just jump how uh, however way you want. Back to square one. You hear that, Eric? You owe me big time. As soon as you're done with your little adventure, you better take me on to the treasure hunt to end all treasure hunts. Yep, yep, yep. Until then, I, I, I guess you guys can look after it for me. Just promise you'll bring it back, okay? Okay, so this time it's not broken. We didn't break it this time. This, this time we actually got to keep it. Is it like an important item? Uh... Doo -doo 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 -doo. No, it's not on here at all. Yeah, 
that's not that's definitely not uh important item it was an accessory a charm increase with defense that sounds like something Silvando should be wearing uh this is a uh, plus 30 up uh, this is plus 15 right here right here just replace this oh only Eric can wear it is that an only Eric type of accessory that sucks he doesn't need this he needs deafness you want to go off the his crits all right well let's go to Angrila and see what's up over there yeah Dragon Quest builders is really really good I have the I have them both love them both uh, the second game has multiplayer when you get to like a certain part of the single player um, it's more like just free building, not like actual storyline type, uh, type of stuff. The multiplayer. Touch the seedling, let's go. Alright, let's see what happens when we, when we actually touch these things. Yeah, the map is really huge. Thank goodness you could just zoom in anywhere. <laughs> this game is huge. This game's like fully open world. Erdwin looks cool. He looks like uh, Erdrick from Dragon Quest 3. The main character of Dragon Quest 3. I'll try to get into a battle soon. Just to show that off. The enemies, the enemies you battle could be really huge too. There's still two more seedlings. There's also seedlings that we also fly to. Are all of these gonna just be on the map? No, it just seems like it was just that one. Uh, let me fly to the other ones. Hold on. Uh, there it is. I know there was a bunch of like a bunch of them in like the secret areas of the game. Uh, when you f where you fly to. So I'll just go ahead and check those areas. Cause there were seedlings there. Maybe those are like optional things? I don't know though. Um, yeah, look, see, there's two. Literally, go to the one on the bottom, it's closest. Look how beautiful this map is. Yeah, so you could set sail, you could fly, you could traverse on, on foot, on horse. If you're sailing, you could sail. You could go to the islands. Um, if you're flying, you could go to the secret areas that you can't reach otherwise, such as this area over here. It's just like when you think you've visited every every place in the game, they give you the boat, or I mean, you, there's the boat, so there's more places to visit, and then you get the the flying whale, and then there's even more to visit. <laughs> Wormwood. More wormwood. I do need to level up. Are there no en there's no enemies here at all? I love this song so much. I'll always I'll always fangirl. <laughs> Dragon Quest 
Did the whale always have a horn on it? Oi, oi, do you go to that? Kedos Nets, so even Lipana Sugat and not the わからないわね。どう関係してるっていうのかしら。あの空飛ぶクジラ、ケトスが邪神討伐の鍵となる存在なのだろうか。うん。考えていても仕方ないわ。残る苗木はあと1本よ。次の苗木を調べてみましょう
There they are. Look at them. That's one variant of them. Look at them walk. Look at them run. These are enemies, by the way. They they're not right. They're they they actually fight these guys. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's they were they were all over me. Oh, that's a lot of them. They have a lot of speed. They're probably gonna go first before any of us. Oh, except Eric. I mean, Eric's fast as heck. And crits all the time. And we got to go. I'll giga crash this time. And down they go. I think that was overkill. <laughs> Serena. Serena went from being one of the best characters in the game to the worst. What happened, Serena? Oh yeah, the time skip. Uh. Oh, Serena. I really don't... Uh, I, I'll just get you that, but you're one point off. Oh, uh, the MM online MM MMORPG, they already made that, but it's Japan only. They have no intentions of making, of bringing it to, to the West. Instead, they're bringing, it's, it's Dragon Quest X, that's a MMORPG. But, um, what they're doing actually is, they're not, they are porting the game, but they're not porting the MMORPG side of it. They're just porting the, uh, they're just porting this, a single player aspect of it. Making a whole new game of Dragon Quest X where it's single player only. It's literally called it's literally called Dragon Quest X offline. ケトスが黒い太陽に向かっている姿が all he did was put the sword up in the sky. <laughs> the seer's back. Yeah, I play fighting games. Just, I've just been taking a very long break because I don't like where fighting games are right now. But Melty's finally a breath of fresh air. Melty blood looks really good. I can finally go back to playing. I just really don't like the state of fighting games right now. I'm literally playing nothing. Like I mess around and I mess around with like like with Zentai for example on uh on strive but like i don't like that game at all <laughs> are we gonna buff veronica even more Yeah, I played the older Melty Blood. Um, the previous version of Melty Blood's my second favorite fighting game. Oh, this is the older Veronica. No more young Veronica. Her curse was broken. It looks so weird to see her like that now. Oh, are they going to transform together into Serenica? Onushira 
預言者様あなたは一体さあ運命の双子よ祈るのだ全ての真実を明らかにするためにシオ and the previous version? <laughs> um シオ and the previous version was mid tier Um, but um, her powered shield version, her powered shield variant of her, um, that one was top tier. I think the F, the full moon version of her was top tier. Yeah, the full moon version of powered shield was like real top. But all the all the other shields were like mid tier. But like I said, this is a like. But I wouldn't. I wouldn't worry too much about uh previous versions like character strengths. This is a new game. Anything can. Anything can happen. Like Kohaku. Kohaku is literally like top two, top three in that game. If if Kohaku's anything like how she was in in previous version, uh, she's gonna be broke. <laughs> she's gonna be like. Pro pro probably like running the game. Veronica and Serena have taken on a new form in order to be closer to Yggdrasil. Their prayers can reach the world tree directly now and guide you on your way. Come close, Luminary. The tree has something to show you. Reach out to the tree. They turn into a tree? Yeah, I'd be, I'd be, uh, I'd watch out for, uh, when they show the character introductions, because, you know, the Twitter is always throwing up the character introductions. I'd throw the character, I'd be, I'd be looking at, uh, pretty intently at Kohaku's. Like I said, she was literally one of the best characters in the previous version. Akiha's looking really good, though, but so does Shio. So, it's like, it's like... Ooh, you gotta go. You gotta watch out. Also, Ar uh, yeah, I forgot Ark, Arquade, or however you pronounce it. She was uh, I forgot which version. I think it was C Ark. She was top tier. Why did the why did the mage betray this guy? Why did the mage betray Erdwin? Why does he look is this King Carnelian? Oh no. It looks exactly like King Carnelian. Erdwin looks so cool. I guess I like him so much because he looks like Erdrick. Maybe he's related to Erdrick. Nan to you kotoja. Korenga cuts the okita shinjits that you no ka. Nakama de aru uranos in uragirare. ロシが命を落としたとはまさか伝説の勇者がこんな最後を迎えていたなんてあ、I Reach out to the tree again. Yeah, this is uh, the Steam version of the game. I'm running at like 290 FPS. <laughs> oh, he had a watcher with him. Oh, those are just keep on the side. Shunakima, 
勇者の剣を扱える者はおらん。I have a 2080 RTX. Uh, 9900 i9 or something like that. Those aren't. By the way, that's not those on that screen. That's not uh. That's not like screen tears. That's the flashback. <laughs> I trust me, it's not. It's not. That's the flashback. What happened to these people? I'm really curious what happened to them. Oh, she was in love. That sword looks thick. She went back in time or something? That's the Tower of Lost Time. I guess we'll see. That sword looks sick. That looks like Dragon Quest uh, IV's main character's sword, to be honest. Is that all her resolve? She wasn't able to go to the past. You gotta break that to go to the past. Here comes all the tackles. Is the elder tackle around during this time? I wonder. Oh, she was the elder tackle. Okay, that makes sense. That sword, I'm not gonna lie, that sword looks stronger than the, the main sword of light. That, that sword literally looks like the sword of light from Dragon Quest IV. Or whatever they call the, the sword in that game, the main sword. They're back, and she's back to being small again. Oh, the, the girl was... That, wo that woman was called Serenica. I didn't even look at her name. I love that outfit that I unlocked for uh, Serena, by the way. That looks so good. Hmm. 
わしの本当の姿を見せよう。あ,あんた。そう、わしはウラノス、伝説の勇者、ロウシュの名前。Okay, that's where the mage was. Okay, interesting. There's a lot of there's a lot of cutscene in here. This is the most cutscene that's ever been in the entire game, like in one sitting like this. Oh, he has Mordigan's staff. Yeah, because he is Morgan. Okay. Okay, so he's Morgan. Tokinokenjawa,命の体重の北にて勇者の訪れを待つ。神の民の力を借り、彼の血を目指せ。勇者よ、どうか邪神を打ち果たし、この長き戦いに終止符を打ってくれ。All right. I don't think we learned how to dress up the whale. I gotta go to the Watchers now. Veronica and Serena learned the mighty magic burst pep power. I don't use Serena because she's not good. She's awful. We're never gonna see it. She's really bad. Oh yeah, I forgot I gotta fly to it. I think I could have teleported to it. I should have I sh I should have took my time reading that list. It's alright though. It's alright. If there's something I should check, um Who's on our team? I should probably check Gundra still. Uh, let me check that real fast, actually. I know I was right there, but I really want to see if there was... Because there's been something with everyone's, like, hometown. So I really want to see if there's something with Gundra still. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Where are you running? I want my XP. The crit master himself. Uh, and then Amore. Good damage. Kafrizzle. Look at that damage. I could just I could just hit this. Oh, that's like no XP at all. Woo, maybe you'll give me XP. I didn't even see you there. Oh, let's get this guy. The guy on the left has a lot of it. Defense? HP? Maybe both? I forgot. Alright, we gotta heal. We gotta heal. We gotta heal. Let's 
Let's just focus uh, this one for now. Bounce. Okay, that's fine. Where are my crits, Eric? Yeah, it's H. Oh, wait, I can't do... I shouldn't do that. I should not do that with, uh... I was about to throw a Kafrizzle, like an idiot. Let's just buff my character. We'll buff 11. There's my crit. I was about to say, I don't even need the buff, then he misses. Both Silvando and Jade level up. Uh, we were going to get all the charms. Did I already get them all? It looks like I did. Yeah, I think I, yeah, I got them all. I think I got everything worthwhile. Uh, yeah, we'll just grab... Pep chance plus five up. And then we got it. We had to like get that pep or uh, the charm for Jade there. Still not there yet. What the heck? Where did he jump from? Rose Typhoon does like no damage on these guys. Uh, you know what? Sure. We are gonna live one more, one one more turn, so may as well just do it. Oh, and the the passive triggers. That trick, that passive is so good. Cutting edge should take it out, I think. Yeah. And we can just end it with critical claim. Let's just do it. Crit, crit, crit. And there he goes. Triple crit. Karina, uh, heal. Heal, Eric. Let's go, let's go to Dungeon Sub. I gotta be careful. This guy jumped out of nowhere. It were massive dragons that were inside here last time. Oh, now there, now there's like standing looking dragons. A royal reptile. This is a new enemy, I think. I don't remember seeing this enemy. If this triggers, this would be crazy damage. Oh, it triggered. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> we could just take our sweet time. Uh, Veronica, just take, take your, take your MP back. Since he's poisoned. Protecting it from magic? I don't gotta worry about that. You're gonna get hit with... What's... The victimizer? Yeah. A divided mi victimizer. Woo! Not enough. Uh, since he's protected with MP uh, by magic, just take more MP away from it. lived Wow it still lived Hey 
Oh, it was dying. All right. Oh yeah, we gotta go from the sewer. Where was it again? Oh. I just want to see if there's something triggers when we go over there. I just have to check. I have to check. And then we could just go back to main quest. Everything's triggered so far with every character when you go to the area where they're from. We haven't had anything with Rab and Jade yet, so let's go over here and see. over here who's this uh, but it makes me want to throw in the treasure hunting towel anyways I I was shifting some rubble out of the way and I found some stairs leading down what looked like a dungeon trouble is there's a really spooky voice coming from down there some poor fellow wailing about how much pain he's in pretty sure it was the go uh, oh yeah that's right it was the ghost of someone who was tra yeah I remember our, our father um, uh, yeah, it's locked. So we'll go through it. We did it in the, we did it after we beat Mortigan. Or, I mean, after we had the fight, first encounter Mortigan. So I guess we got to do it again. Yeah, the treasure chest is clo is locked over there. It's unopened. Oh, there's no enemies so far. Looks like it's a straight path there, maybe. Sage's elixirs, those are good. Yeah, this is the spot right here. Yep. Let's heal up completely just to make sure. We gotta fight this guy again, but this time he's malicious. So he's gonna be stronger. ちょっとあんた。そこで何してるのよ。その人をどう I gotta rescue our father again. Jashin Sama Mesometa Okangete Wanga Karadani Mosu Samaji Chikarana Minagite Ilunota Kono Yono Zetsbo Subete Kuraitskuser Hodoni Kono Nagekino Senshua. 16年前の お主の父親じゃ。国は滅び。愛する家族とは死に別れ。この男の絶望は。まさに高級フルコース。この男の絶望は一度食べたら忘れられぬ。
べても食べても満たされぬゆえもはやこの男の絶望だけでは満足できぬ次はお前らの新鮮な絶望を食らうとしよう Alright Malicious Gloom Navor And he goes first Instantly lowers the magic Magical mending and might of Sylvando and greatly buffs himself. Strong start for the enemy. Uh, unbridled blade. Yes. 455. Eric is pepped up. We're gonna divide. Can I, can I poison him? No, doesn't seem like it. I'm gonna umfo Eric so he can get a stronger crit. Greatly buff Eric there. Eric goes first because he's just that fast. And we get guaranteed triple crit. Nine sixty-eight. Instantly puts Sovando to sleep. Ah, uh, Sovando's dead. That's not good. Pepped up. Um, I'm gonna use this to revive Sovando. Um, where there's a, so the what move was it that I'm looking for? There's a move that protects you from breath attack. Is it Veronica that she doesn't have that move? No, she she doesn't have that move. Someone has that on this team. Uh, someone on this team has it. Samo. Jesus. I'm dead. Okay, we gotta we gotta heal. Alright. It's not magic though. I gotta find who has it. Oh yeah, he does have Kazamo though. I guess I should. Yeah. As expected. Double Kazamo. That bounce would have been really good. Oh, was it you, Eric, that has it? What I'm looking for? No, definitely not. Okay, I'm gonna cast Bounce. Oh, it's a single party member? I'll use Magic Barrier then. And uh, we gotta heal. Is it... Was it you that has it? There was someone, I'm, pr I'm quite sure someone had a move that protects against breath attacks. I don't remember. Was it Was it the hero? Was it Eleven? Let me see. Oh, I have, I have a... 
I have a revive move. It's definitely not me. I don't remember. It's alright. Let's just go in. His attack power drops. He's destroying our magical might and ending. It hurts Sylvand <clears throat> it hurts Sylvando's heels. Oh, he still has divide, okay. I cannot critical claim. I just attack. We got a one crit. Pepped up. They have oh she does not. I was about to say that does she have any uh pep power moves? I'm gonna I'm gonna actually um for eleven. And then heal us up. Less of a heal because he did increase my decrease my magical mending, but it's enough. And instantly falls asleep. So Vondo, I really need you up right now. What's your pet power? Edge of sleep. That's really, really good. He's not divided, so I should just use that. And he falls asleep. Same as Sovando. This is the umfuld unbridled blade that's gonna hurt. And he's dead. That was tough. 36,000 XP, that's a lot. Eric leveled up and Hendrik. Uh, Eric, did I already get everything up there? And yes, I did. Oh, yeah, we we're gonna see what's around here. Oh, yeah, attack an enemy and absorb their HP. Eh, uh, sure. Sure. Fights like that would have been really useful. And then we'll just grab these two so we can see what this is over here. And then Hendrik. I don't even know what I'm doing with Hendrik. I'm just getting axe stuff just because I... Maybe I want to try that soon. Down they go. Hello, Father. It is I. And there's Aileen, was it? Was it Aileen? Was it Eleanor? One of those two names. Our mother. Eleanor. そうだな。エレノア。あ。私の可愛い坊や。<笑> 
あなたにはこれからも多くの困難が立ちはだかるでしょうそれでもそのまままっすぐに進みなさいあなたの中にある希望の光がきっとあなたを導いてくれるはず父と母はいつもあなたを見守っていますよ And they're gone. Kore de Kontoni Oakarejana. Ah, win. Ah, win. Elenoa. I know there had to be something here. But it still isn't anything to. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I found the princess pledge. Princess's pledge. I also found. Erwin's helm. And Erwin's armor. Let's go put it on and see. Well, let's see if it's any good. Oh, it's a. Uh, I can actually change my outfit to it. If I. Can I plus three this? If I plus three it, it'll be better than what I have on. If I. But it shoots my charm up quite a bit. What about the armor? Yeah, it's better. Uh, it also elemental damage redu uh, taken reduced by ten percent, curse reduced by thirty percent, and what does the helmet do? Same thing. So it's stacked. What the armor? How do I look with the ar with the uh, armor? Daddy's boy. I matched the sword perfectly. Look how perfect I match my sword. Perfect. Let me move my character over there. I mean, I, I'm, I'm fine. I am fine. Oh yeah, and the, uh, the other one was an accessory, right? No. It was an important item. A symbol of the love of a Drusillian royal for the son of who was stolen from her. Alright. Yeah, we can go to Havens above and rest. Um, I'm gonna go to any random campsite just to rest up. So we can get our HP and MPs restored. And then we'll go towards the Watchers and proceed the main story, I guess. Uh, we'll rest. So night. Um, I'm gonna check real fast if I can upgrade that helmet. I uh, gained uh, maximum focus uh, increased by two. Wait. Uh, rework. I can. Increase Erwin's armor. Uh, the helmet too. It costs 20 pearls though, so I can only do one. Um, we will go with the helmet just because. Um, I'd like it to do a bit more defense. Give me a bit more defense. It's only like five points off. It really doesn't matter. But putting them both on would be pretty nice, so we can get double the uh. Uh, elemental resistances and curse resistance. I shot that one a bit too far. That sucks. I'm gonna just... That one's okay. Uh, triple whammy that one. Double whammy it. Perfect. I'm gonna just double whammy... That one. Focus cost reduced. Perfect. And, uh, that's like borderline plus two, plus three. I'm thinking plus two though. The top left one was shot a bit too far. Yeah, I thought so. Plus two. 
it was shot a bit too far. That's totally fine. Not a big deal. We'll put it on. We are set. Let's actually go. That, why, why do I always do that? Why do I always do that? Uh, this is the button I wanted to put. We're going to Havens Above. Let's go to the Watchers. Let's go to where we actually gotta go. Are we going to the Elder? I would, I would guess so, to be honest. Oh, maybe we're going in here. Maybe? I don't think so. Yeah, we gotta go to the Elder. So let's uh let's get out of here and go to, uh around the corner to where he is. I say around the corner even though he's technically like all the way up there, but yeah. Alright. Here we are. Oh, Kaili Nasai must say, you shall summon. Say, not a naive Karamanika Wakari must. The tiny little distant cousins of Majin Boo. It's kind of funny because I'm I'm only just now thinking to myself. Every single elderly person has a uh, a long must a long like face uh mustache uh goatee whatever. Joker tells. Ego tap about the seedlings and what, what we witnessed. They all have like giant white mustaches or goatees? Facial hair, I guess I should just say. Honore go to the Tower of Lost Time? Of this, uh, of this history, of this timeline, I guess I, I could, I should say better. Oh yeah, we do needed that little thingy to get inside. We received the wheel of time. Again. <laughs> All right, so we're flying out of here. I'm going to go to the Tower of Lost Time now. And we're going to speak to Serenica, uh, aka the Elder Tackle. That was at the very top of the tower. Mm. 
There it is. All right, here we are. We haven't been here in this timeline. More tech, we got some Technicolor Dream Cloths. It seems like it always is there. All the tacos climbing up to the top. I wonder, is the chest in the back still there? I gotta check. Oh, it's already opened. Even though we've never been here before. So, some of the places still have the chests open. There's a cog shaped indentation in the door. Put the Wheel of Time there? Yes. You know what I'm, I'm curious? The, did they give Rab that one move back? Yes, Kamikaze? Yuck. Disgusting. Oh, he does have pearly gates. Okay. That's what I was wondering. If he had pearly gates in this timeline. Even though he never did any training with um that one woman. I don't remember her name. kind of funny you do like all this like work to get stronger in this other timeline um but all, all it takes is the seer to do one one wave of one wave of her like her hand or her wand or whatever the heck she used and you instantly gain so much strength Yeah, the chests here are still open, so there's no reason to go check up, check the other areas. Alright, we're at the top now. Altar of Ages, and there she is, Serenica. Love how Morgan was like the dark one. Now is like, oh yeah, no, 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 the real dark ones here. I love this voice right now. The timekeeper. I love their voice. This 
聖地に伝わる目覚めの調べだお姉様もしかして<笑>時は来たれり今こそ目覚める時大空はお前のもの舞い上がれ空高く I wonder where in the world did Erdwin and uh, his party learn about this. Our whale. Yeah, the whale didn't have the horn. I didn't see it, at least. Yeah, it did not. Yeah, it didn't. I knew it. Oh, look how much cooler our pet whale looks, Tessia. Now we can break through the uh, a lantern or the uh, the thingy in the sky. Should I should say, not the lantern. Yeah, the, the, the Tessia is finally talking with us. Oh, you mean to the uh, the the locked door that was down there, right? A test before the final battle. ケケカイ。打ち破ることができるでしょう。ボンデルフォンの地下迷宮か。確かに邪神と戦う前に準備をしておいた方が良いじゃろうな。いきなり仕掛けても勝ち目はないってわけか。仕方ね。今は力をつ
We're going to need to do some serious training if we want to stand a chance against Kalasmos. So I say we go to Zwords Rust and see what this trial Satessia mentioned is all about. The quickest way to get there is to zoom into the Warrior's Rest. Yep, I know. Order for unlocking Satessia's true power and crossing the skies to do battle with Kalasmos at last. We got the Master of the Skies achievement. We go up on the whale just to, just to zoom off. The game's just like, yeah. You're just gonna zoom off the whale now. Kind of funny. We're all rested up and good, all and all in good shape. Let me uh, also save the game as well. In a little bit. Level sixty-three. Let me get my horse. Oh, we weren't even that far. Wow, the horse can go across the poison. That's so mean. Alright. Here we are. The store was locked now with a with a magical seal, but not anymore. I wanted to go down here and see what was here. Now we now we're finally here. There's a strange glowing symbol on the ground. Step on it? Yeah. Justin's labyrinth roam between worlds. Have the trial aisle. Travel the world until you're ready to face the dark. Okay. Trial aisle is the chamber in this in this shadow world. I think fighting here might benefit me. Instead of being green eyes, they have red eyes. They're vicious. So that should be a lot of XP, right? Only I can only imagine it. Vicious Bongo Dongo. Droid. Bongo Fandango. Wow, I dodged it. Uh, 3.7 XP. Uh, fight stronger enemies. Rose Typhoon. Kaboom. These guys don't have much HP. They may look like they do, but they don't at all. 4.4k XP, that's better. What about this dragon up here? The Ethereal Serpent. Kaboom! Rose Typhoon might end it. Lord Typhoon! 
Surprisingly not. It's all right. Wow. Hit that one before it goes. And, uh, before it does its turn. Crits for 516 damage. That's good. 5.6k XP. Better. Still not better than that other area we were at the begin at the beginning of the post game. Yeah, I'm gonna do so do, do the fighting just to get the uh, XP and stuff. I want to get there and realize I'm getting absolutely destroyed. Because <laughs> these regular enemies hurt already too much. Three thousand XP. But I think it's good. This is a lot better than uh, what it used to be um, in the main game. Because like the main game was like, nothing hurts you. You hurt everything real hard. You're, ne you're never going to die. But it's nice to see that game's harder, which is what I wanted. I wanted the game to be harder. Otanoshimi! <laughs> Look at this big guy over here. Oh my gosh, why is this a thing? This guy's huge. Noble dragon. Ha, ah, he's poisoned. Eric's gonna wreck him. Bam! 695. I guess I could have umfold, but it's not a big deal. I guess it was a big deal. Ha! <laughs> uh oh. Vando doesn't get to go. That's sad. I wanted they. I wanted. I wanted that heal. Yes. Down he goes. Veronica leveled up. She gained a whole 14 points. Nice. Uh, magical might increasing even further. She's already strong. And then increase magic ma max MP. Nice. Veronica is so good. What's this? Okay. I guess this was the only way to get this 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 mount. Need to mount this guy to break the ice. Hey. 
Thousand XP. Now ride the invader. Let me get this. Uh, let me get these items over here real quick. These materials. Ruby, sapphires, amethyst. Out of the way. Charge! That's so sad. We, we just destroyed the cub. Alright, I'm gonna get off. I don't need you anymore. Vicious goobonces. They're fast. It lived. That one's confused. Don't worry about that one. We'll, we'll attack the other one. I don't know if that one already attacked. No! It didn't attack. I screwed up. I took, I took needless damage. Alright. The enemies are too stunned to move. That's what I like to see. Good morning, you beautiful person. Whatever morning is to you, whatever evening is to you, whatever... You have a very long morning, I guess. I just realized her, her, um, Veronica's wand looks cool. I like the design. Destroyed that one. No, that's, uh, that's easy Owen to. fight all these enemies at least once They're, these enemies are fast it. focus the a1 before it goes and makes its turn there we go that doesn't mean anything Zentai trust me just, I'm gonna just go Owen too. It's at that point of the stream where I'm very, very, very hungry. If I the next save I get to, the next save that I locate, probably gonna be where I cut it. These guys, but a short version of them. Or were they always that small? I like the fact that it does confuse them. He hasn't went yet, so take him out. Or he does go. Calls for backup. I knew he was gonna crit. Yep, 
Yep, his name was Hooper, man. Yuda! Five point seven K XP, that was a lot better than the other enemies so far. Let's just start fighting more Hooper Mans. Um I'm running out of MP for Silvando. How far is he from leveling up? I'm probably going to... I was going to say I was going to Quadra Slash, but Veronica went first. I'm, I'm still going to Quadra Slash. No, no, not, not worth it. That one's confused there. So while it's confused, attack this one. And then we focus this guy. Heal the MP. Four point five K XP. Oh, the poison. Poison's really bad in this game, but I'll take it off. Not a threat whatsoever. There was one JRPG that's like really threatening with poison. I forgot what game that was. A Realm Between Worlds. Oh, there's a save. I hope there's not like a, a whole bunch of these. And we restore HPs and MPs on these things. Oh gosh, you're gonna hit 80 hours. Alright guys, like I did say, I'm gonna cut it here. I know since I just got here, but I am actually very hungry. A little bit on the shorter side of the stream today, but hey, it's alright. I'm gonna, we'll pick this up uh, next time, whether that's tomorrow or the day after. Um, hopefully we'll be able to beat the round between worlds and uh, face off against Kalasmos and maybe beat it. I don't know. We'll have to see. It might be a long stream it might, if I want to actually try to beat the game or beat the rest of it. But anyways, hope you guys have a good one. Um, be sure to follow me on the social medias. Follow me on Twitter. Uh, follow me here on Twitch. As well as to subscribe to, um, subscribe to the YouTube. Because like, if you want to watch, like for example, this Dragon Quest XI playthrough from the very beginning, you could do that right on there. Anyways, guys, take care. Have a good one. I'm off to eat. See ya.